hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video i'm gonna be doing some self-care i'm happy to just dive straight back in because i've been away for three months that's because my camcorder got stolen but i'm back now and i'm kicking it off with some self-care some self-love so as you saw i use the rose water and the bath salts the rose water really helps to soften up the dead skin so it's good give it a try it works i'm gonna soak my feet in this hot water well it's you know hot enough to a temperature that i can manage i'm gonna soak for about 15 minutes next i go in with this wash so these are feet products that i got from my local pharmacy and i'm gonna leave all the details down below if you care to search for them online so you always start off by giving your feet a good wash then i'm gonna use my pumice stone to scrub underneath make sure that i get away as much dead skin as possible but trying not to be too harsh with my skin and overdo it because it can hurt and it can cause cuts Next I'm going in with a exfoliator for the feet and this is really not harsh at all on the skin. I barely feel the salts that they've added inside the cream. So I'm just using it because I've bought it really but um, it's not such a strong harsh product on the skin. And each of these feet the care products were one pound each, so they're not really, you know, the most amazing products, but they did the job. I don't know if I believe the information given that there was someone by your side coming back inside my body for a second. There is no way that I'm never gonna try. Hello. Where you at, where you been, tell me everything about you, go slow So I can write it down and become the perfect man for you What you like, what you don't, you should never be flying so
then I go in with some hot oil well it's not hot um, it's an all-purpose oil so you can use it on the hair the skin the nails and today I'm using it on my feet to sort of do a hot oil treatment um, just to make the feet extra soft and smooth this is good for you to do like in the night as well and put a socks on while you sleep it really softens up the skin and if you want to see how I made this oil I'll leave a link in the description bar or in the i cards and I'm gonna keep the cling film on my feet for about 15 to 20 minutes and put a timer on so you can go ahead and put some socks on your feet after this as well I think I did off camera but I wouldn't sleep in the cling film I would only put the oil and the socks on I'm going to wash away the oil and just get my feet to just give it a bit more soaking in the hot water and make sure it's at a temperature that you can manage Next I'm drying my feet and I'm going to go in with some nail care. And you can see already just by looking at my feet that they feel soft. They really do feel so soft. That's why I like to take these steps. I'm not thinking about the way you keep my world from spinning I'm just thinking about your eyes Just don't know if I've been faking or pretending But I know I never felt so damn alive I don't know if I believe the information given That there was someone by your side So today I decided to go for a beige um, nail polish But first I'm gonna go in with my nail polish base so that I can protect my fingernails so they don't stain from the color that I choose to put on and I typically do two coats let it dry in between and then move on to the color and this is a Sally Hansen nail polish I'll leave the details down below as I said I am going to do two coats with this as well let it dry in between um, and you have to make sure that when you're layering your coats they are thin so that you don't get like a bulky wet finish because otherwise it takes forever for the nail polish to dry so I do two thin coats and allowing it to dry in between I'm just thinking about our lives You and me just laying blankets on a beach And then at night I'll sing your favorite lullaby I'm so glad I didn't give up easy Chasing after you Hello Where you at? Where you been? Tell Next I'm going in with a Sally Hansen top coat and this one I think I just did one layer at this point I was tired and I just wanted it to be over but also I didn't want the nail polish to take forever to dry and then smudge because it really is a headache when that happens and 
Now I'm going in with foot cream. And lastly, I'm going to seal in all that moisture with some coconut oil. And if you notice, I'm not using a ton of product because I don't want to overdo it and just have, you know, slippery feet. Even though I'm going to wear house slippers after this. But yeah, this is the way to take care of your feet at home, guys. Save some money. You know, you can even make it a whole night with you and your girls and just do each other's nails or do your own nails, whatever. So this is really cool and it's a good part of self-care but of course we all know that self-care is not just on the outside it's also on the inside but um, yeah I just wanted to make this video for inspiration and for myself so these are my finished results let me know what you think don't forget to like share comment and subscribe see you later